love one, welcome back to Yandere Simulator. So this week we're going to engage in a little bit of social sabotage as well as investigate some of the new stuff in the, the recent builds. So this is going to focus on social reputation but also frame ups and such which I've already recorded. So let's have a look. So we're going to change our panties to something else. We're looking for gossip. Yes. Now, I know there's a better way to do this, but I don't know how to do it. Max out our seduction, which should make everyone believe us more. And I wonder if there's a cheap to get something. Oh no, I need to do panty shots. Alright, how many do I need? Provide student info. No. Provide dark secret. Okay, I could do that. Maybe? Yeah, I just need eight. Right, okay, there's plenty. We're also just gonna max up my reputation. Because we're gonna take a bit of a reputation hit in about five seconds. And by a bit, I mean a lot. So, my, now's a good time to describe how this system works. So basically, you can take panty shots to get information out of Infochan, because that's the kind of currency she deals in. I love how nobody is stopping me, like, it's so very obvious what I'm fucking doing. Uh, send. Cool, see? <laughs> She's like, what the fuck are you doing? Ah, here we go, right, provide dark secret. You're gonna love this, I've got video footage of coconut selling used panties to a boy from another school. Thank you! Now we just wait. Sorry, my phone's ringing. I'll be right back. Okay, take your time. See ya. Not to call me when I'm at school. Like I said, that was a one-time thing. I don't want to do that again. H how much did you say? What are we doing? Well, if it's just one more time, then I guess it's okay. Uh, how about tonight? Where we met last time? In Sesuta Town? Okay then. I'll see you tonight. I can't believe I'm doing this. Tut tut tut, is somebody engaging in prostitution? Maybe engaging in compensated dating? Interesting. So now we've got some juicy gossip. We've got some stuff worth knowing. Time to start spreading rumors! Gossip bound. So, I'm pretty sure that the panty thing should be helping. Like, I'm pretty sure that's supposed to be implemented at the moment, but I'm, I'm not sure. Truth be, truth be told. Also, gossiping ruins my reputation too, so what I might want to do is compliment them so that it's offsetting that. So as you can see, her reputation has taken a massive hit so far, and I've just told all the boys. Like she's got a negative fairy reputation. Now in order to stop a girl from daring to talk to Senpai, we just need to take her reputation all the way down to a hundred. But, but, we could go further. Anyway, self sabotage time. So, now that we have some information on, you know, Kokona, well, we can write about her. Yep. I 
saw Kokanaharika in Sisita Town. And she was engaging in compensated dating. The act of dating an older man for money. And post. I thought I saw her. I didn't think it was her. I wasn't sure if I'd say anything about it. Seriously, I didn't think anyone would be like that at our school. That's pretty gross. No, Kokana Chan is not true, is it? And so the self uh, and so the sabotage has begun. Now, because your reputation is thoroughly trash, you will never, ever, 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 ever be able to confess to Senpai. But how do I put this? If we really hate this girl, if we want her to suffer, if we want her to never ever show her face in public again if we want the entire school calling for her head on a platter we can continue we can continue all the way until the entire school hates her na hates her and wants her dead and will tell her to her face that she should die because they will do that after all Teenagers are so, so cruel, aren't they? See what I mean? You! Talk to me! Well, You've got- Actually, there is something that I need help with. Uh, excuse me, mate? Really embarrassing, but... Well, I lost... I brought us somewhere at school. I can't find it anywhere. D don't ask me why my bra is missing. It's a long story, okay? The I is, I could probably guess. There's a bra lying around. It's mine, and I would really appreciate if you'd return it to me. Oh God, this is so embarrassing. I bet you were having sexy you times on school it? ground. Thanks. I hope you find it. I I I think I know where it is. Let's see, if I was a student trying to engage in sexy time activities on school grounds, I would go to the most romantic place. By the way, that's new. It's a garden class. For garden clubs. We can go look there later. Yep, that is definitely a bra. I'm going to send that to Infojan. <laughs> She's like, I don't get it, what are you showing me? I'm showing you this bra, doesn't it look nice? It's a very nice colour. It wouldn't suit me, but I think it would. I think it definitely suits its own, don't you? Yes, you found it. Thanks a lot. I owe you one. Yes, you do, and you're going to regret owing me anything. I promise. There's the nurse. Hi, nurse. Still don't do anything. Good to know. Good to know. Hey, uh, you gonna follow me? Cool. All right, this way. Come on, that'll be fun. So Saki, I really wanted to show you this awesome cupboard. Isn't it amazing? No, uh, I want to close that. Right, as I said, it's a really amazing cupboard. So. Yeah. Come on. Nope. Uh. Yeah, you need to come with me. And you're going inside the box. Okay? Alright. Shh, shh. It's okay, dear. It's okay. I'll see you after school, Saki, okay? Yander Chan waits until the clock strikes midnight. Under the cover of darkness, Yander Chan travels back to school and sneaks inside the main school building. Yander Chan returns to the instrument case that carries her unconscious victim. She pushes the case back to her house, pretending to be a young musician returning home from a late night show. Yander Chan drags the case down to her basement and ties up her victim. Exhausted, Yander Chan goes to sleep.
So guys, I just had like the best night ever. You see, I finally got to have a slumber party. Look who I brought home. Look at her. It's Saki, my friend. Hi. Oh, I just really wanted a slumber party. Oh, what's this? I didn't know there were tapes in my basement. How long have these been here? Oh, I'll do something with them later. Hi, Saki. We're gonna have lots of fun. Let's see, what should I torture you for? I can come to school an hour late. Or I can miss school. Or I could have fun with you all day. Let's have fun all day. What do you say, huh? <laughs> this is gonna be fun. <laughs> what are you doing? Don't come any closer. Stay away. Sorry. Stop. No. It's just I really wanted to use this drill. <laughs> God, I love slumber parties, don't you? They're so fun! I never want it to end! In fact, I don't think she wants it to end either! Do you? Well, what do you say? You yes, it's me again, your friend! <laughs> Let's see... Hmm, I'm gonna skip school again, we're gonna have more fun! Let's see, uh, let's use the blue torch this time, okay? Did I use the blue torch already? My bad. Sorry, I just can't keep track of all of these uh, wonderful toys. Ah, uh, it's Thursday morning. We should probably go to class today. And by we, I mean me. How you doing? Hmm. Gonna have to torture you a little bit. Sorry. Actually, not really. Just one more. I know, I know. It's okay. Why are you doing this? So obviously the problem with torturing our little in the morning is that, you know, we can't really do much. Uh, we're going to be late for class, so we can, uh, we'll miss out on fun stuff during the day. Like anything that's going to happen here. Anyway, we've got to make sure Senpai gets home nice and safe. And, you know, we got to have our slumber party again. Hi, Mia! You can torture you for four hours. Perfect. Let's do it. Got this wonderful new device. Uh, Why are you doing this? Because who else am I going to use the cattle prod on? This is a very serious question, Miyu. <sighs> People just don't understand. Anyway. How's your sanity doing, Miyu? You enjoy our slumber party? Me? Anything? Define anything. You say. And what do you mean by that? Hmm? I obey any command. Any command, you say? seem completely and utterly mind broken. Let's go to school! This'll be fun! <laughs> Hi Mia! Let's see. Do it. Kill. 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 Yep. Hey everyone, me you came back to school, isn't that wonderful? God, I wonder who you're gonna kill.
takes an impressive amount of force to get a knife through your head. Oh my god! No, it can't be. They're horrible! They're dead! This is a tragedy. Why would anyone do this? I'll call the police immediately. There's been a death at Academy High School. We need help right away. And I didn't have to do anything. <laughs> oh, that was a wonderful slumber party. We're gonna have to do that again. The police arrive at school and discover what appears to be the scene of murder-suicide. The police discover the corpses of Kokona Haruka and Saki Miyu. The police discover a knife that is stained with the blood of Saki Miyu and Kokona Haruka. They find the fingerprints of Saki Miyu on the weapon. Oh, interesting, they don't find mine? I mean, I handed it to her. Saki Miyu is dead. The police cannot perform an arrest. The police question Yander-chan but cannot link her to any crimes. No sir, I have never ever had a sleepover in my entire life! I don't even know what a sleepover is, I mean... Why would you do that? It's, it's, it's weird! The police conclude that a murder-suicide took place but are unable to take any further action. The police investigation ends and students are free to leave. How tragic. But even more tragic. I stalk Senpai until he's gone home safely, and I return home. But! But? Shouldn't the game be ending right now? Anything on the internet? Taro Yamada. Your name is Taro. Okay. So, shouldn't this game be ending right about now? Pretty sure this should be ending because my ri uh, rival should be getting Zenpai today. I suppose the police investigation put a damper on that. Let's play some video games. Yanvania, Senpai of the Night. Oh, this is such an obvious love letter. Move with the left and right, run by double tapping, crouch by holding down, attack with X and jump with Z. Right. Okay, I can do that. Let's play! I mean... Heartbreak! again given love. I was called here by Senpai, who wished to pay me tribute. Tribute? 
You steal boys' hearts and make them your slaves. <laughs> Perhaps the same could be said of all girls. Your words are as empty as your heart. Senpai ill needs a girlfriend such as you. <laughs> what is a senpai? I don't need a senpai. A pile of heartbreak. But enough talk. Have at you. Is that the same girl from school? I have no idea what I'm doing. I missed. to hurt her, but she hurt me too. Oops, that was my fault. So how do I recover health? Alright, so I can't hurt her while she's like this. That's fine. Okay, how did this take me this long to realize? No, ha! You're dead! Senpai is mine! The Academy Institute is a boarding school that teaches magical arts to young men and women. Who have high potential for wizardry and witchcraft. Sogwarts! Once every 100 years, under the glare of a full moon, the ghost of a long dead succubus will appear within the Institute and beg one of the Institute's upperclassmen to resurrect her with a tribute of blood. If the succubus is resurrected, all of the school students will vanish, except for any students who were in love with the upperclassmen that resurrected the succubus. Oh, this game is to be believed. If that would be about 11 girls. If the succubus is not slain before the sun rises, the school students will be forever lost, and the succubus's full power will be restored. The succubus can only be slain by a young woman who is in love with the upperclassmen that revived the succubus. The time has once again come for the forces of love and lust to engage in their ancient battle. The Institute beckons you, and no man can say who shall emerge victorious. Ah! Come on! The disc is scratched. 
You don't take care of your desks, Yandere chan? Really? Just, just go to sleep. I can't even look at you right now. Alright, well, I think that's going to do it for this episode. We have successfully ruined Coconut's reputation. Oh, that's the martial art. Wow. Okay, then. So we can spy on the martial arts club from the occult room. Nice. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. As always, please leave a like and comment if you did. Subscribe if you haven't already to hopefully see more Yandere Simulator. And I don't know what I'm going to do for next episode. I'm thinking maybe go around and find all the cassette tapes and maybe do a bit of lore building if that's the kind of thing you're into. But if you've got anything that you'd like me to try, please feel free to suggest it in the comments. And I will see you then. Until then, we got to do our favourite activity, which is... <sighs> Stalk Senpai. So... He's so cute. Look at him. And best of all, with Coconut gone, I have them all to myself. Anyway, until next time guys, take care of yourself. Bye!